Hello, Gemini. It's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of August 12th through the 19th, 2019. The cards I'm using today are Wisdom of the House of Night by PC Cast, and I'm closing off with my Spirit Song Tarot by Pauline Cassidy. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, guys, let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Gemini? All right, so I do feel like somebody has a new kind of confidence here because that flipped on out, okay? All right, so I think uh, a secret is getting ready to come out. And I do feel like somebody's going to have more confidence about whatever the situation is, all right? Let's we'll shuffle a little bit more. I don't know if I cut y'all, so I'm sorry. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. All right. Forbidden. Oh, goodness. All right. So it seems like already here, somebody may be dealing with somebody who is in a relationship and an engagement and a, a marriage um, and some kind of legal situation or just doing something that's not so legal okay somebody is definitely in some kind of forbidden affair okay so this is the lover's card basically and it seems like somebody needs to make a choice okay are you going to stay with your partner or are you going to go um with this new person or are you going to I keep dealing with this person is married or are are they going to choose you or their husband or their wife okay mm. okay so i do feel like somebody is trying to pay attention trying to look real deep trying to focus on what they should do okay what is right for them okay so seems like somebody is it's a hard decision i do this is crazy but it's true i do feel like somebody has the same amount of uh love and care as uh with their um let me just say husband or wife than they do with um their mr or mistress okay okay all right so of course success reverse I do feel like somebody is, is just finding it very hard to choose between the two, okay? Very, very, very hard. Oh, wow. So, uh, we got the strength card reversed, so somebody feels like they just can't do it. Somebody can't make a choice. Somebody is trying to see and figure out who is best for them, um... I do feel like love is at one of both of these situations, but I honestly do feel like some kind of a contract is what's keeping them away. Um, so I do feel like um, maybe if somebody lives with somebody or maybe somebody is uh, engaged or married, I do feel like that's what's um, holding up the choice, okay? Because I do feel like the care and the love is equal. But I do feel like that extra commitment, that extra contract is what's keeping you to this person or keeping this person to you. Okay? Okay. All right. Yes. So, yes, somebody just doesn't have the strength right now to let go of the one that isn't the best for them. Okay? Okay. Um, but I do feel like it's some kind of a monetary economic issues that's keeping this person. So if you are the person with the economic attachment to your partner and this sounds like you, they're going to keep the economic attachment. So if it's a house or cars or just marriage, I do feel like somebody is like not wanting to get rid of all that or have to deal with all that. Um... I can't even say they starting over new because I heard five, six. So this could be going on for five or six years, five or six months. Okay. But I'm feeling like five or six months at least. Okay. Because I feel like whatever it is, it's old news. Like, okay, I've been around for a long time. I know about this person. Okay. All right. Forbidden. So, yeah. 
the earth card reversed uh, to me is like somebody is just like not willing to t make changes okay not willing to make changes somebody's trying hard but they just not feeling like they're gonna be able to make the change they got something to do with the contract okay all right let me flip this over first okay oh so we got the belonging card reversed so this is crazy because when this person home they feel like they belong out there when they're out there they feel like they belong home and i do feel like there's a lot of back and forth going on here so this person really feels like they don't belong anywhere okay all right so we got the loyalty card so i do feel like somebody is trying to keep this loyalty and i feel like they're gonna send that hurtful message like you know i love you but i can't leave my family, I can't leave my house, I can't leave my car, you know, I do feel like somebody does have a loyalty to their, um, more so possessions, because they love both of you guys the same, okay, and I do feel like they're going to send a message, or you're going to send a message about this, okay, all right, so let's see what's going on with the Gemini, whoa, we got stuff shooting out already, all right, so we got the Ten of Feathers, so ending, transformation, recovery, okay? So I do feel like somebody's going to end one of these other situations, probably the situation on site or the whatever situation without contracts and try to recover and rebuild the, the home foundation. All right, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on, Gemini? Gemini, Gemini. All right, so we got the star card reversed here. So I do feel like in this relationship, you're not getting what you're hoped for. The person that you're dealing with is not getting what they hope for, okay? It's just like a, you know, I thought this was what I wanted, but that's that card of not feeling like you belong anywhere because you feel like you belong to both of these people and both of these people belong to you and you just can't have one or the other. Um, so I do feel like a sense of loss for a while. Okay, so we got the Ace of Crystals here. So I do feel like somebody's going to end up losing a lot of things in the process, okay? Mm. So this makes me feel like this is to the person who's leaving the contract. So I do feel like, of course, there's going to be two, two choices. So I do feel like the person that's leaving the contract not going to get what they wish for. Okay, so I do feel like somebody got that home situation. Somebody is very pushed to, like, I'm going to stay home. You know, this is a good foundation, um, but I don't feel right here. Okay, or somebody's going to choose home, and then they're going to turn around and say, okay, I don't want this, sell everything, and go to the side person. But I do feel like with this side situation, things are not going to work that great. Everything is not going to be what you hope for. Okay. All right, for acorns, so of course it's going to be an unstable situation because it was started in the middle of a marriage or a middle of an engagement. You know, that trust level gets cut in half when you got situations like that, okay? All right, three of acorns. Goodness. Okay, so what it's looking like here is somebody's going to stay home first. Stay home first, and then when they start feeling like I made the wrong choice, they're going to dip off, and they're going to go with this third party, okay? That's this three of wands represents to me. Somebody's going to leave and go with that third party, okay? Then they're not going to get what they wish for, okay? This third party is not going to be anything that they really wanted, okay? All right, so we got the eight of crystals here. I don't know. This makes me feel like somebody may have something to do with work. Um, or somebody may just be working real hard to try to make this third party situation. I mean, what this new relationship with the third party work. Okay. Oh, God. All right. What's going on with this four of acorns reversed? 
All right, so the temperance card here. Okay, so there's nobody to get mad at but someone's self here. So I do feel like somebody's going to be mad at the instability, mad at the fact that uh, you, they can't be trusted 100%, okay? And it's because someone left a whole relationship for this one. So that trust level will never be there. That stability will never be there. And, you know, it's just like a... It's crazy. Because <sighs> it seems, I mean, this it just wrecked everything, okay? The third party situation wrecked everything. Okay, so we got the magician here. So I do feel like, <sighs> I do feel like there's a lot of manipulation going on here. I do feel like, I do feel like you are going to get what you want, okay? In in both situations, you wanted the of the home life, the home life ha happened. You wanted the the relationship on the side, it happened. But I do feel like you're not going you're just not happy with, with what's going on. You're not getting what you hope for. So it sucks, but it seems like somebody got to start a new slate and start over new. That's the only way you're going to find contentment and happiness um in a love life because this one it's just too twisted, all right? But that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.